So it looks like the Ace family is under some heat. Well, Catherine specifically. So let's get straight into the drama. As you guys know, there's been a lot of heat on Austin recently. Him smacking his child. Disgusting. And this weird video. <laughs> Wow, that looks like something that should be on OnlyFans. But I'm making my son. Okay. Anyway, it looks like it was doing really well for Catherine because she decided to open a skincare range. Oh my god! Just a couple more hours until 1212gateway.com websites go live. At midnight PT, you'll be able to navigate through our website. Launching tomorrow, December the 12th at 12 p.m. Give me your fucking money! 1212gateway. 1 plus 2 equals 3, 1 plus 2 equals 3, so that means it's 6-6 six, six, gateway, it's a Illuminati. Guys, the website ended up launching and there was a lot of purchases going through. To try everything. Mama, 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 ba, 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 ba. Can't wait to try it. Uh, I've got my holiday gift set. I'm so excited to try out Catherine's new skincare line. Oh my god. But due to the high demand, a lot of people weren't able to purchase products and weren't happy. Was about to order the 1212 getaway holiday set of back and get myself. But it's sold out. Jesus Christ. Congratulations. You deserve this success and so much more. I until you restart. Only thing left is the beauty oil. Sold out in less than an hour. Congrats, love. You deserve it. Glad I was able to order what I wanted in time. So pumped. Captain Pierce, please tell me you're going to restock soon. Oh my god, literally buy stuff and they went out of stock in my car. Damn, but everything looks so amazing. Even though there was a huge success, people started to notice something very fishy in Catherine's website. The links in her private privacy policy were linking to JLo's website. I'll wait for you today. A tea page by the name of Spill Sash spoke about it. That part of her website is linked to JLo's website. And we had a look ourselves to confirm this and yes, it's linked to JLo's website. If you thought that little thing was bad, it got worse. Our people started to complain about their products and customer service. Just as I thought, trash. My order for 1212 Gateway was confirmed and I was charged. I have not received what I ordered, nor have I got an email with the tracking. I've contacted 1212 Gateway support email and no reply. Please help. Why haven't I got my package yet? 1212 Gateway, Catherine Law, why ain't going to see this? I thought I was the only one, man. Have you heard anything, Wolf? I've also messaged them on Facebook, Instagram, and messaged Catherine and on Snapchat since she does reply sometimes and no reply. I guess we should wait. I feel like I'm the only one who hasn't gotten my order. You're wrong. I haven't either, and I ordered 1212 the day in launch. Mine hasn't even been shipped. Girl, I Mine's December 12 and still didn't get it. Oh, I spent over two thirty some dollars and didn't get issued. Ain't nobody got time for that. Now the company did respond to some of the concerning comments saying, Hello. For those of you who purchased full-size products on the 12th, your orders have come in very soon. Production time and processing of orders have taken longer than expected due to the holiday season and restrictions nationwide. We apologize for the delay and appreciate your patience with this matter. We expect shipments to go out in the next 72 hours and you will receive tracking information at this time. We are very excited to get these products to you as soon as possible. However, not everyone received the same announcement.
Some people even complained about the product itself. I guess the ones who received it. This ID messed up. The packaging is horrible. Absolutely horrible. All the products have been used. How could you do this to us? Why do it? Oh my God. Hello. Hello. I just sent a DM reference to an issue I just had with the box I received. Did anyone else lip balm come broken when you first removed the plastic part? I received my order on Saturday, Wolf, that I ordered on 12-12. The packaging came ripped up with things open. I'm not impressed. And someone complained about what it did to their skin. Gave me pimples. If you have sensitive skin, do not use it on moisturizer. They both have heavy scent or essential oil. Itching and burning, itching and burning. After the website was linked right to JLo's website, it ended up changing. But all they did was copy JLo's statement. Here are the receipts. All skincare companies, even though they roughly have the same policies and etc. A lot of them look very different, as you can see here. Maybe JLo inspired her. That's a possibility. Or maybe the company that she's working with is tied with JLo and JLo's working with the same company as well. And they're helping JLo and Catherine create skincare products. So let's get into my conclusion. What was the issue? I love the reason! The website maybe was linked because it's not really her. She's just teamed up with a company that's going to help her put her label on it, I guess, and a website name, and boom, you got skincare products. This isn't the only time Catherine had posted a really bad product all for money. She had done this before with iPods that were very shitty quality. Basically, a guy, allegedly, some French guy, paid her big sums of money, and she promoted it, and this guy bought these crappy iPods from some website, and he was able to pay a lot of other influencers like DDG, Domo Wilson to promote his product and he ended up making millions of dollars. Of course, this is all alleged. So yeah, this isn't the only time that she promoted something really shitty. So I would definitely be careful of buying something from her because just because it says it's from her doesn't necessarily, it really is her behind the scenes doing every little thing. Probably someone feeling some gas in her ear and she's cool with it. But hey, what do I know? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. It all started when Catherine was promoting ePods on her Snapchat. Hey guys, so I recently started using these wireless ePods to work out and it's honestly like the best way to work out and listen to music and be active because you don't have anything in the way. And so I contacted the company to see if there was any way that we could get a discount for my supporters. And I did, of course, and this is why I'm making this and I'm so excited because instead of these ePods being $159, they are going to be $29.99 with my discount and it's going to be going on for the next 24 hours. It's super exciting because I also um, get free shipping using the code Catherine. So they are going to be 80% off for the next 24 hours. All you have to do is swipe up and putting the link right over here. Um, it's a really good deal. They also have black, which is cool, but I personally like the white ones. Um, and it is uh, wireless and it's Bluetooth, so you can connect it to whatever device you have. And again, free shipping with the code Catherine. So the ePod is going to go by fast. It is Bluetooth wireless, which is cool. Now at first glimpse, this website looks legit, right? Got these e pods here, $29.99. God damn, for $159. Already they're deceiving you. It was never that much. Acting as if they're processing 32 orders and 132 people are watching them. Disclaimer: shipping will be delayed by two to three weeks due to, to very high demand. Hmm. 